You know, I skip out on one Hearthstone expansion, and suddenly people stop playing Nomis and Mechathunes and Holy Rat Paladin? What the heck? So I'm gonna bring it back, this time, with Mechathune Warlock. I mean, there's a new card called, uh, Valgris Valgorge, who draws you four cards, which empties your deck faster. Which is good, because if you have an empty deck, you can kill your opponent by blowing up your own Mechathune, right? So shouldn't Mechathune be number one right now and with the new nerfs people don't know what to play like the galakron decks got nerfed so 99 percent of the latter are confused this is where we capitalize and bring mechathune back ha, this guy's toast okay we look to have a little bit of a mirror matchup but he's most likely zoo not big brain mechathune like i am Ooh, not the greatest hand. Combo card, combo card. Dark Skies is not terrible, because you can use it to clear. It also might be Handlock. Handlock is really popping right now. In which case, I most likely should have kept Voodoo Doctor. But we'll see if it's Handlock. Come the dawn, we shall see. It could be AFK Lock, which is the number one counter to me, because I don't want to stick around while he AFKs and ropes every turn. Okay, it might be AFK Lock. Our uh, win rate against AFK lock is about 100%. Oh, it's okay. He apologized. He didn't realize he was in the middle of a game. Okay, I got questing Explorer on turn 2. That's always nice. But he has a 1-drop, which is not as nice. I have a Dark Skies, which is nice. Some nice things and some nice, not-so-nice things. Get Evil Genius here. I mean, it's okay if you Evil Genius, huh? Oh god, he hits the juggler off the top deck. Ah, as long as he doesn't triple shoot this, it's fine. Okay, he didn't triple shoot it. This is, what, 6 health on the board? Oh, the heal has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 7 health, huh? If I play Dark Skies, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... I'll just coil whatever left over. Yeah, that's probably what play. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh no, it counts itself as a piece of damage. Oh, right. Because it repeats. Math is hard. No, actually, if that wasn't a question of math, I was just reading. Reading is hard. There's no way this game gets to the Mechathune stage. Like, absolutely no way. So I might play Galvanizer just for tempo. Yeah, there's no way. Oh, okay. Actually, there might be a way. But it's fine. If I save coin... I will act as your steel. Ah, great. Imps. Sweet. Love it. Love it. I Plague of Flame this. I think it's fine considering the options. Because I want to, I kind of want to coin the Veldris Felgor. I can wait him to overcompensate a little bit. Must mm, maybe I can be patient. I don't know. He is going to eventually flip the board, right? But my Godfrey cleans that up nicely. I think this is a reset button. I should try and save it. I also want a Valdris. I think I should save it. Plague of Flames are too good to just pass up for to use on a one one unit, right? Might summon random fat demons too. That's fine. Can I afford a turn to Veldris here? I think that's fine too. Because next turn I can just Lord Godfrey and clear the board, right? This is what? 9 damage? Which means it's a f I l at an effective 14. I don't have much ways to heal though. Effective 14 health without ways to heal. Besides another Arasani Broodmother. Hmm. We must expand our minds. 
I'll take that risk. It's 14 damage here. Mm. It is a risky play, but I'm a risky boy. Yeah, he's going full smork. Unsurprising. How about a new How about a new Gonna get a double trade here. That's hey, kinda annoying. I got you, friend. But Lord Godfrey will clear this right up. Clear this nonsense up, he will. Look at what he does. Clears up nonsense. Down to five cards. His Galakron is, I want to say, not fully upgraded yet. Man, maybe I should have played yes, that. Yes, That's fine. He's drawing cards and not flooding the board too hard, which is always good for us. Hey, I got you, friends. Ah, that's annoying. That ordering is not so good. The fires of vengeance burn bright. Mm. How do I clear the board here? Mm. Could just do a Plague of Flame. Of I'm gonna draw a way. card. If I lose that ability. I can't clear the board here, right? What I could do is just Plague of Flames. And then play a Doomsayer. It's a 4 mana hmm. play. That's a 3 mana play, right? What a vermin. I have value smart damage. Probably not. <laughs> Doomsayer here, and then maybe just plot twist. Maybe heal and plot twist. Just plot twist. Also complete my quest instantly. Damn. Okay. My one regret is using my Galvatron. I didn't think I would get this far. Honestly, I did not think I would be here. So Maybe I can hit a zero mana Mechathune and uh, recover from my mistake. It's like a 50% chance to hit a Mechathune, right? If I draw it, I can shuffle it back into my deck. What a sound of mother. Zero mana Elven Archer. That is cheap. Let's play the Arasani. Zero mana Elven Archer. Doesn't help in killing my mecha too, right? This guy's toast may have made a huge mistake, but what else is new? Maybe Zephyrus can give me Galvatron. He's like, ah, you need something here, right? He's got the hookups. Bones of the fall. Perfect. Sure. sure. Dude, I need to run like Hellfire or something for these guys. Zero me mana Mechathune. Wait, that's bad because I have to play Plot Twist. Wait, hang on. <laughs> I can figure this out. I'm a smart person. How much damage is this? One, two, three. Uh, nine damage, right? Computing. I trade everything in. I'm pretty sure Dark Skies clears anyway. I hope you like my invention. Every Sonny Brood Mother is going to be a pain in the ha and a half, though. The end is coming! Okay, how do I play Plot Twist with the zero mana Mechathune in hand? Does it keep the mana reduction? I would love it if it kept the mana reduction. That would be great, as Tony the Tiger would say. Bones of the fall. How about a new How about a new yeah, that's fine. Ish. Zephyrus, what can you give me, buddy? Help me out here, friend. 
Flame Strike. Flame Strike does deal with the board really well. Okay, Curse of Weakness can also buy me a couple of seconds here. Oh my god, those are some gigantic demons. God, this Aristani is kind of bad for us, as are the Voodoo Dolls. The Solarium is bad too, because it's drawing three cards. Must destroy. <sighs> he has 13 damage on the board, right? Let's hope he doesn't have second fiendish, right? He used two faceless corruptors, though. God, I'm gonna die to fatigue. Crap, I'm gonna die to fatigue. If I plot twist... One card away. Damn. I should have drawn. Do I have too much card draw in this deck? I might actually have too much card draw. I never thought that would be a real problem. Too much card draw. GG's. Damn, so close. Maybe I should reduce some cards in this deck. Alright, so I ended up taking the Arasanis out and then putting in um, more cheap one cost unit because I felt like the main thing I struggled with was um, emptying my hand fast enough. Because I think card draw is fine as long as the cards are cheap enough so that you can empty it quick. Uh, this is another Zoo Warlock. Quest into Questing Explorer is the dream opener, no doubt. Could be Handlock, but Zoolock is extremely popular. Way more popular than Handlock right now. Way, 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 way more popular. So many possibilities. Oh my god, how are we both quests? Of course it's the right way. Mom, I'm recording a video. Okay. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. Um, by hero power, it's he looks like I don't think he's Mechathune, is he? What are the odds that I run into the one other Mechathune player here? This wasn't on the map. I can't play this until I draw a Mechathune, unless I want to live on the edge. Quest lock versus quest lock. This is the second opponent I feud into, and he happens to also be a quest lock. Small world. There are dozens of us. Dozens! I don't think he would be Mechathun quest lock, right? I think that would get into weird territories. I need to save this for Mountain Giant. Okay. Interesting. Things are happening right now. Yes, Arasani. Haha, <laughs> the fool. Arasani is a bad card in this match. What kind of idiot puts Arasani Broodmother into their Mechathune deck? Not me. Not, not me. I just plot twist this. 
might as well, right? I should have plot this before I played the card. I can draw cards a little faster. I do like Velzger's Felgor though. He's so much extra card draw. If he is Mechathune, he needs to play Arasani Broodmother, which is so slow because you want to maximize all your mana right now into drawing cards, not playing Arasani Brood Lamer. Bone Raid. Okay, he's not running what I'm expecting him to run. I'm gonna plot twist again. I think that's fine. Start getting the hero power going. Man, Veldris Felgor. I shuffled him twice. He keeps coming back each time. Ah, zero mana Voodoo Doll. I like that. Let's play the card draw first so we know what our options are. Ooh, Solarium. I can't play this until I draw Mechathune, though. You have zero mana cards. If he's not Mechathune, those zero mana cards might be a problem. Most likely just gonna hit face. If I play this, I go to eight cards and then I draw a bunch of cards for free, right? We must expand our minds. Dark Skies. Three mana, deal 12 damage to the board. That's just good. That is just good, ladies and gentlemen. So what kind of deck is this guy running? Kind of feels scary to Voodoo Doll this, when he could play some really crazy stuff. Alright, we need to play all the cards that draw cards. But we've played them all. Yeah. we played them all out. That's good for us. Real good. No, we need to play Solarium. We don't want to get stuck in the same situations as last time where we die through fatiguing ourselves. Hello? Discover a spell. Oh, can he discover... <gasps> Demonic... What's that card called? Demon Portal. Demon Possession. Demon something. Eh, I probably wouldn't worry about it. What are the odds that he finds it? Double motor coil this, motor coil you, and then I motor coil you. Then I, I figure out what else to do. Someone call for the doctor. No mana doomsayer, huh? Can't say I'm excited about that. Of course, it's the right way. This is gonna start emptying my hand a little bit. Hmm. Why do I make sure Zephyrus gives me a very cheap card to play and not an 8 mana Tyrion? There's no way he's Megatune, right? With this. What if he's Malagos? Uh, zero mana Megatune, big fan. Big fan of zero mana Megatunes. So now I can play. This without much worry, right? Hmm. Must destroy. This will be a mercy. My hand is too full. Rift Cleaver. Destroy a minion, your hero takes damage equals to its health. You are a mecha Toon deck. You're the worst mecha Toon deck ever. Okay, I don't have to play these cards. They get discarded by themselves, right? Yes. Can I play Dark Skies without minions on the board? I believe the math here lines up. Extraordinary. All right, since fixing my deck, I have a hundred percent win rate. 
Let me do the math. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. So I do this first, right? Then I do this. Wait. Wait, why are you here? <laughs> no, it's an echo. <gasps> no. <laughs> okay, note to self, echo cards will regenerate itself. Oh, God. Okay, I hope that doesn't screw us in any way. Like, it looks like we're fine. <laughs> rogue. That's right. A rogue got nerfed by one mana to um. What's the card I'm thinking of? Um, the Necrom Apothecary now costs five mana. Ooh, this is a nice combo. Solarium into Plot Twist. Dark Sky's not bad as a follow up as well. He also doesn't start with coin, which is good. The problem is Rogue has a significant amount of burst damage. Am I only healing our Voodoo Docs and Potion Vendors? Who has the strongest potions that I need to buy? Full Mulligan, that's a good sign. Please don't play the Feral Cat on turn 1, because that would be very annoying, that little cat. Noise. Noise, 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 noise. Alright, all is chill and who's bill. Don't want really wanna shuffle the coin into my deck, you know. Nothing we want to draw is a coin. Yeah, I think it's better to use the coin. Straight up. I shuffle this. I can maybe top deck a one drop. Nah, let's go for the greedy play. Cause even if I play the voodoo doctor, he's just gonna stab it. Better to use this, cause um, it's more less value of a stab. I shouldn't play that. No, I always have to play something. Oh, uh, okay, that's fine. We can call it. Thank God. It's a pretty tough guy, actually. Could have been a lot worse, though. Could have been way stronger. He's gonna put on as much pressure as he can. We have Plague of Flames and Dark Skies. So, a couple of options. We want to clear the board before we play Veldris. Veldris is a very slow turn, but it's a lot of card draw and prevents us from milling too, so Veldris ain't bad. We're gonna hit 18. When you hit one card draw card to complete so our quest here. Options. Fine, all he's putting on right now is just one one. Play that. I should just play it. I hope you like my invention. I wish I had the mana to use this hero power this turn, but Someone's it's fine. Born. I'm not gonna Elven Archer that. I'd rather save Elven Archer for like a voodoo doll down the line. He hasn't applied much pressure just yet, but he's on five mana, so he can start coining uh combo and Galakrons. So Necrom Apothecaries. What is this? Battle card store adjacent minions to full health. Yeah, his pressure this game has been non existent, so it's really good for us. I'm trying to decide whether or not to Doomsayer. I think Doomsayer is fine. Just because we plan to Veldris next turn, this forces him to spend mana dealing with Doomsayer and then going for a play. If he has Death Rattle, it'd be extra annoying, but. The Death Rattle package did get nerfed. 
Oh, this is fine. Totally okay, totally okay, not a big deal. Dark Sky kills it here, but I'm down to just wait. Six damage is a little dicey, but this one a few times. Veldris Felgor can be played at a price of six health. Significant, yes, but um, it's a price we gotta pay. Going coin nine drop. Life and hope. Oh god, that's fine. We have a uh, Lake of Flames to play with. My Shadow Step Alex Raza. That's fine too, cause then. Okay, that's a little not as fine. Hmm. Get the mathematically correct play is this. Oops. I need a lot of one cost. Oh, I should save this for Plague of Flames, actually. Ah, this must is with my Plague of Flames. A place to hide. Why are you playing out? This might be Deathwing if you can't play it. Seems here is fine. Honestly, Lord Garfrey is fine here too. I love the fact that I can always like mill myself. I think right now maybe I should stop drawing cards and start spending mana. Now I can't play this until I've played Plot Twist. Just yes, second Doomsayer here. Because I played this, I still have to play Plot Twist, which means I shuffle my reduced Mechathune, which loses me the game. There's so much of these little missteps that I can make with this deck. It's kind of scary. There's also the problem of Ysera Unleashed. All those Dragon Dream Portals means at any given point he can have a giant ass dragon. Hopefully the Doomsayer just makes things awkward for him right now. Oh, he does run the Necro Blade package, huh? Just hitting me in the face, that's fine. Also, if I shuffle Mechathune in and I hit it with zero ma the reduction, that's also a very nice one. I want Zephyrus now. I feel like Zephyrus is going to give me crap. It's a plot twist. Is it me? Oh no, never mind. Your wish is my suggestion. Uh probably just Edwin. The Brotherhood shall come. My final turn. Ugh. Nars Domu! <laughs> My final turn should just be Curse of Weaknessing. Oh, that's annoying. Uh, if I save Edwin, that means I have a target to. No, I, I need Edwin j on the board just in the case. Brotherhood shall come Let's go! Hmm, is he gonna do things in a way where I won't have a mortal coil target? That's pretty smart. I have my last Plague of Flames and a board full of units. So I might be okay here. Alright. 
Does he have a way to mess with me? I will act as your Lord. Can you discover anything? A spell? A minion of some sort? A minion of any sort? Alright! Mechathune is back, ladies and gentlemen. It's back. GG's Hey, lights out.